All right, guys, welcome to another episode of MotoGP 20 career mode. And we are at Brno, so I love this track with these bikes, really fast and flowing. So let's just see where we can place ourselves for the race. All right, the final turn, a little bit shallow, come on. But we should be fine, I think. Yeah, we should be fine for now, all right. I'll see you guys in the race. All right, guys, welcome to the start of the race. Come on. P2 for now. Luthi on our inside, but we swoop around the outside of him and back into the lead. We go into the first turn. That's good. But he's still down our inside. Come on. Oh, that almost was a big crash. All right, come on. Now I'm immediately gonna try and pull away if I can because I don't wanna be fighting too much. Alright. Kanet is in P2? What? Okay. I have no idea where Bezek is to be honest. I forgot to look. Or Baldessari for that matter. Come on. Can I try to go down our inside? He's actually keeping up with me pretty nicely, so it's good for him, but not so good for us. Marini is in P10, so that's not too good from him either. I think P11 now, maybe. And I can't see Bezeki, so that's good for us. A little bit early on the brakes, but. Alright, come on. Can I try to go down our inside again? And that's lap 1 of 10 completed. Let's go. Pizek is in P6 and Baldessari P5. Alright. P4. <laughs> Baldessari just moved up into P4. Alright. Well, it seems right now we are at the lead. Oh my god, everyone is still right here. <laughs> okay. Let's try and break the, the lead, of, uh, lead group off so that we have a little bit more breathing space. Holy shit. Two of them went very wide, and that moved Bezeki right up into P3. And P2. Bezeki is right behind those guys. If I saw that correctly. Oh no, he's back in P3. Alright. And now he's in P2. Come on. Now let's see if me and Bezeki can pull away or if it's just me or if more people will join us. I don't hope so. I hope it just will be me. But I'm guessing a little bit more people will join us. So. Alright, come on, we're pulling away a little bit. 0 0.6, nice. Let's see what it will say across the line. 0 0.6, and Bezeki had the fastest lap, alright. So Bezek is definitely putting in work to keep up with us right now. So Alright, come on. Oh 
a little bit too hot from us okay pull it back still 0.6 so that's good and Bezaki seems to have broken away a little bit too so it looks like it will be just me and Bezaki again the two rookies at the lead of the race fighting for the championship nice <laughs> really fast, okay. Alright, come on. Zero point five, half a second. It's stable for now, the gap. And that's Baldessari up in P3, so the top three in the championship are 1, 2, and 3. Okay, let's see if Baldessari can keep up with us or close the gap. Or if he's just gonna hang behind. Jesus Christ, Bezaki. Okay, we almost posted the same lap time. Wow, alright. I definitely have to get a move on and hope Baldessari isn't quick enough to catch us alright come on Monzi and Pons are fighting as well. Switching every turn. Okay. That's surely not gonna help. But they're having a nice battle for P29. Come on, let's see what the split says. 0 0.8, nice. Alright, so we're extending the gap now. And Baldessari is dropping back, so that's good for us. And we posted at 596. We've extended our gap to Bezeki, which is good. Come on, let's see what the split says. If I can remember where it is. After this turn, right? Yeah. Alright. 1.1, so we're definitely breaking away now. Oh, a little bit of an extension there. I hope we get a good offer for next year from MotoGP, though. I like to go with Ducati or with Suzuki I think and no it doesn't have to be <laughs> the factory Ducati team Pramac is fine with me as well to start off in at least maybe I'd even consider Yamaha but I don't like the Hondas I really don't in the previous MotoGP games either the Hondas just don't suit my riding style for some reason I can't be quick with them. Uh, yeah. Yamaha is 
okay for me but Ducati is really good and uh, Suzuki I'm really quick with so I just hope that's the same case in these games or in MotoGP 20 not that all of a sudden because of the new braking and stuff that I'm slower with those bikes and quicker with the Honda A little bit shallow, but that's fine for now. Alright, and we're halfway through the race, come on. Another fastest lap by us, but I think Busek is going quicker. No, he's not? Alright. Because he closed the gap a little bit. And my rear tire is starting to get a little bit lively here because it's sliding around a little bit more. And behind Bezeki, there is a nice group of what, five, six bikes maybe? Can we see you? Yeah, five bikes, and one is hanging behind a little bit. pulling away from everyone else right now so that's good but still Bezeki is keeping up with me again and for some reason I'm kind of expecting him to be a little bit quicker than me in the final stage of the race that he's starting to close in on me again like what has happened before so I'm kind of pushing right now to extend the gap that we have so that we have a little bit of a buffer for in the final stage of the race but I, I shouldn't be sh sliding the rear around so much. <laughs> Alright, the speed up. Uh, guys are fighting with each other as well. And Baldessari is in P5. Where's Marini? In P10. So he's definitely dropping off the lead of this race. And the championship if he's continuing this. for me there and if you hear like construction noises I'm sorry about that they're doing something in my backyard but I can't fully um, eliminate the sound of the construction workers so if you hear that, I'm very sorry for that, but you just have to bear with me. And it seems like P3 is starting to break away a little bit as well. A little bit too deep, but that's fine, come on. second gap nice all right come on final three laps and we posted another fastest lap as well so that's good oh a little bit too hot come on pull it back
Yeah, P3 is definitely pulling away from the other guy, so... I thought it was Navarro or Giantonio, so I, I don't have to, I don't have an idea right now, but... You can see when we cross the line in the next lap. a little bit too shallow into the turn oh no 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 damn it why did that give me a penalty even though it cost me time that's some bullshit right there 0 0.7 all right come on Starts making silly mistakes now. Come on, get it, get it together. Looks like he's right there now. All right, come on. Okay, so Navarro is in P3. Baldessari has moved up into P4. And we're in the penultimate lap, so let's go. Still right there. A little bit too close for comfort, to be honest. Going a little bit too late on the brakes. And Bastianini is battling Baldassare for P4, which is good for us for the championship. So keep it up, Bastianini. Beat him. <laughs> oh no. Half a second gap, alright. Into the final lap we go almost, come on. <laughs> it's, it's too close guys, oh my god. The stupid penalty gonna fuck me up this race, I, I swear. Slide right there, and P3 is really started moving. Jesus, he's cleared the gap. What almost two seconds to the guys behind him? Oh, a little bit wide from us. Come on, all right, come on. Close now, 
guys, come on. Oh, gone hot. Come on. MP3 is really closing in on us as well. Jesus, what a pace. All of a sudden, where did that come from? Will we be 0.3 ahead of him? Oh my god, come on! I d he put up one finger, so we. M yes, 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 we just got it, guys, nice. Bezeki second, Navarro third, and Bastianini fourth. Well, the Sari finished fifth and Marini seventh. Alright, so that means we're in the lead of the championship, right? Yes! Alright, let's go, guys. Lead of the championship is back in our hands. What a race, nice. Alright, team championship, we moved back into P uh, P3, so that's good as well. Alright, let's go. Alright guys, so yeah, there are no upgrades that we can do, but this might be interesting to show you. Um, contract search, look at this. Um, these guys have started to show interest in me, so we're definitely going to be able to move to MotoGP next season, but the question is which team do we want to go to next year? KTM, Ducat, uh, Ducati, or Aprilia, maybe there will be more teams... Um, offering for next year but we'll have to wait and see um, but that will be it for this episode guys I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'm actually gonna put it at 115 now because I think I'm winning a little bit too easy especially because the qualifying is I always get pole position like that so I'm gonna put it at 115 for the Austria Grand Prix and we'll see how things go from there um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye